You don't need to swim in this water. My name is India and today we are going to check out one of the world's greatest natural creations, the Dead Sea. The Dead Sea is known for being the lowest place on Earth and one of the saltiest. It is nearly 10 times saltier than the ocean. That is exactly why you are able to float effortlessly on top of the water. Because here, your body weighs less than the water. So while you might not be able to walk on water, you can certainly float. Actually, the Dead Sea is not really a sea. It is a salt lake. And it's a salt lake that is so salty that you will not see any fishermen here because there are no fish. But despite its name, the Dead Sea actually gives life. The minerals in the water here can help cure skin conditions and make your skin extra smooth. That's why people from around the world come here to get muddy. You could say it's like a spa in the middle of the desert. And don't even think about drinking this water. You'll want to spit it right out. But as special as this place is, I need to tell you something heartbreaking. The Dead Sea is dying. Some experts say that by 2050, the Dead Sea could dry up. The Dead Sea is shrinking for a few reasons. First of all, some companies are extracting large amounts of mineral water from the Dead Sea. They do this to produce things like chemicals or simply beauty products. Also, water from the Jordan River that would normally go into the Dead Sea is being redirected to cities. This greatly lowers the amount of water that flows into the Dead Sea. Thankfully, there are efforts between Israel and Jordan to save the Dead Sea. Since these countries both share the Dead Sea, they shared the responsibility to save it. There is actually a plan to pump water back into the Dead Sea. And this plan costs over a billion US dollars. Today, it is our responsibility to speak up for the Dead Sea so that governments will continue to take action. This special gem sitting in the Middle East needs to be saved. So let's hope that the Dead Sea will stay alive for future generations to experience. This is the Dead Sea. This is Inside Israel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.